Welcome back, everyone. I know you were dying to see the next episode, so without further ado, civilian power plant, well, civilian power reactor. Oh dear, oh dear, what is this? Why am I in the center? Oh. Well, this is fine. We spawn her up here, and one there, one there. Okay, yeah, I can handle this. What we'll do is we'll actually try and spawn. Try and spawn a few things. It appears we are not getting very close. No one's coming towards us yet. So we'll take that as a good thing. Build up our wee nutrients. This human is getting rather close. But I need nutrient. I need more nutrients, so we're gonna go this way. Oh, the boom slug! I played off really well. Okay, in the downtime, more builders. I'm going to go down the way. Probably be able to force their hand even by going this way. Time to swap back to spawning all of them. <laughs> I'll do a bit of the music back on. Was getting a wee bit quiet there, lads. Just me and my thoughts. <laughs> uh, anyway. Oh, can we kill him before he does any damage? Yes, kinda. Not great. Back, 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 back. I mean, at least we're getting money for killing these. I know on normal difficulty, tanks only have 40 health, and then on this difficulty, they have a, a whopping 80. 80 health. That's why we have no swarmer spawn. That explains why there was just no troops on the on the battlefield there. Are we tank in the bottom corner taking pot shots? What are you at, sir? Commandos, do not let them in close. That's what happens. Okay, well, I guess we should just move with our swarm. Okay, we're this this whole being stuck in the middle has uh, definitely not been the most productive thing. But what I can do is I can run everyone up this way. With enough borrowed time, we could hopefully uh, destroy these. Come on, get the get the get these hives built.
Oh yes, we are close. Oh, they, they are close. Take out that spawner. Just That's all I need. I just need that spawner done. Gone. Not, not fantastic. Okay. Our backbone of economy has collapsed. Whoa, 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 whoa. Whoa. Whoa! <laughs> Gonna lose our only hive, no! Rather not let that happen. Okay, this is a bit risky. I, I know, I know what we're doing is extremely risky. Okay, back to spawn everyone, come on! Stop them here. There's a lot of tanks moving in. Okay, okay, we took out the north flank, that's good. Builders, just you just keep doing your thing. Okay, okay. Now we can swap back to overall building. Send everyone back north. Except the builders. We again are just going to keep building. And then hopefully what they'll do is they'll start nutrient gooing everywhere after the last buildings are complete. The spawner up here has got to go first. So what we're going to do is we're going to spawn two of these here. These guys will just continue to annoy me, but that's kind of to be expected. Oh. How's this one going? Yep. Okay, we've, we've took care of that spawner. That's one down. Okay, losing that hive isn't actually too much of a problem. Wow, that was a quick, really, really quick turnaround there, wasn't it? Drop over to plus one damage. That was a bit dicey. I didn't, you know, I didn't want to lose the level there, but it was close. One of the closer ones to being lost, anyway. Oh, everyone, get that weak command over there. I love how we we patch of bones and all. That's all that's left. left in the corners. Oh, these guys. Okay. Tesla Targe, you may deal damage, quite a bit of damage, but you are no match for the number of swarmers and defenders we've got. Let's 
stragglers dine a night. We can just push back to the north. Their last wee hold up of resistance. Few commandos and tanks. Lots of marines and flamers, but few boom slug shots and uh, we have successfully tamed this reed. Two more. Nice. Right. What is next? Well, to be honest, I am totally okay with just giving two points. Well, maybe not two. Boom slugs can be made to move a wee bit faster. That'll be good. Okay. Let's go. Simple military outpost. 9 out of 10 difficulty. Let's go. What we're looking at. Oh. Shot clean off. Three spawners really close. Okay. So our problem right now is just how close it is. I wonder if I rush this. Nah, rushing this is a bit stupid. going to have to be ready for what is coming because they are going to be very 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 quick to react here okay thank goodness they have not sent anything yet Okay. Okay, now we've got a bit of life. A bit of life from them. Let's go. We have to meet them in the field of battle. They have us a wee bit pinned down with uh, the location. But one boom slug. And that's all they wrote. Okay. We are going to actually sweep in to the bottom. Good place to start. Or good place as any to start. the builders busy. In fact what we'll do is in some of the downtime we will in fact do that. Right back to spawn on a load more of them. Oh yeah, nutrient generation is exactly where we want it to be. These tanks are not having the easiest of times dealing with us. There are three spawners whilst they do have a lot of trips. Them grouping together is one of our greatest advantages because we have really, really fast, really, really strong boom slugs. Let's go. Boom, one down, another down, two down, entrance is open, and there we go. We can change over to attack, can we? I think we can. Boom. Cat boom. Yeah, I think this is the beginning of the end of them. Such a high capacity. First layer of defences have fallen. Spawners within sight. 
spawners are actually going to start taking major damage very, very soon from every boom slug explosion that gets close. Be looking out for this guy. This guy, MVP. MVP, bam. He was the first to get a bit of damage, but definitely not the last. Swarm to the bottom. Actually crank it up to just spawn on as many as we can. And there we go. Command center down. The rest of them to fall soon thereafter. Tis good, tis good to beat the game like this. A wee bit of strategy, lots of auto clicking. Love it. Five bats. Easy peasy. Two evolutionary or evolutions. Right, where are we gonna go? I think the nutrient goo needed to be picked up. Huge spawn size. Warrior, we haven't picked him up yet. He will he will actually be next. And we'll make our postules worth more. Military weapon facility. Three upgrade. Nice. Okay, so... I remember this one. This one gets real dicey quite fast. Because I think one time they sent a tank at me. Like, right away. No, no warning, no nothing. Just tank. Here, might be able to get some some massive economy going here before before the first attack rolls in. Back for now. Rush everyone this way. See if we can take take out a really easy command center early on. That would relieve an extreme amount of pressure off us. Notice there wasn't actually a lot of AoE flamers at the front, so took out the walls relatively fast. I think we'll be able to take this out. We can move up. Boom slugs should clear a really, really good path for us. Shouldn't have actually let up any pressure on them. One commando is destroying a good backbone of our economy, and I don't appreciate that. Oh, plus one attack is now the new, new upgrade for us. Great job that have been afforded that luxury. Command center down. There we go. No spawner on the left to annoy us. We can probably just push straight on through.
that one tank over there. That's creating a bit of a bit of a problem for us, isn't it? Please tell me someone, yep, someone's going to take care of that problem at home. We line a spawn, a spore launchers just to keep any, any stragglers back. Oh, no, we can just push on to win. Okay, let's go. Yeah, we'll start, stop, well, stop these. Wrap around the side, two more houses and that pesky tank from earlier. There we go. Four minutes. End area five, brilliant way to conclude this episode. These are a wee bit more difficult to take care of, but it is not the final one. Area six is the final one. So I'll see you all in the next episode, lads. Hanky.